Welcome to the Crimson Engine. My name is Rubidium. Today we are talking about lighting, uh, photography lights, and film lights, and taking headshots. I'm shooting a headshot today for a friend of mine. Um, I thought that might be interesting to show you guys behind the scenes. And there's a couple of lights that I have had for years that I really love. Um, they just updated them. They're called the Generay Spectro LED. They are circular LED arrays, so they give this really amazing highlight in the eye, um, sort of like the sun or like a lamp. I use them in this clamshell arrangement where I have a upper one, which is maybe three times the size because it's inside a optional um, octobox you can buy for it that has an inner baffle. It double diffuses the light, makes it really, uh, really soft. And then the bottom one I use um, on a kind of chicken leg um, low stand to give a top and bottom bounce. You can see if I turn this off, it's a, the, the top is a really nice top light, but it gives me those skull eyes. So if I balance it out with one on the bottom, I get um, dual highlights in the eyes, which I really like. Um, you can also rig these directly overhead and have it sort of like a top light, which lets you move around 360. And then for my, um, my backlight here, I'm just using a um, Quasar T80 on a lighting stand um, with a CSAN clamp. And I've got that on a little um, $10 lamp. I bought, originally bought these lights to use as interview lights, uh, matching pairs, because I didn't like the square that the um, one by one panels gave you in the eyes, the reflection. And I have since used them for almost everything. Um, I obviously a lot for headshots and photography. I use them for my narrative stuff. Um, they'll show up in Neon Noir a couple of times. Um, just because I really like that overhead balance with the under um, light. It's very stylistic. It, it needs, you need to sort of motivate it. Um, but if you can get away with it, it, it is a really beautiful light to use um, that isn't uh, seen very often. It has a lot of crossover value between photography and filmmaking. That's the Generay Spectro LED 14. Um, they're available on B&H. They have a bunch of accessories, inclu including a cool little remote control that lets you adjust the light remotely. Um, like I said, the uh, the softbox, the octobox is really, really helpful. Um, and the fact that they're cheap, you can um, really get a whole interview kit for under $1,000 with all kinds of modifiers um, that won't break the bank. Thanks very much for watching. Leave your questions in the comments and I will see you next time.